What if you had a tool where you could upload your videos and the tool would help edit the videos for you effortlessly? That is what Canva Magic Design for Video does and in this video I want to show you how to use it and I promise you you're not going to be disappointed. Let's get started. So we're going to go to Canva. You can use the link in the description down below to create an account if you don't have one. It's also going to allow you to access Canva Pro for free for 30 days. Yeah, so when you go to Canva, there are two ways that you can access the Canva Magic Design for Video. So the first way is coming to the Magic Studio here and then just scroll down to the second row here. So you can just click on the Try Magic Design. It's going to take you to the Magic Design for Video. The other way is just for you to go to Create a Design and then we could enter here maybe Instagram Reels. Yeah, because it's going to allow us to be able to create a short form video. Okay, so we have our blank template here. And now we're going to come to the left hand side. This is what we are going to use. It says generate videos easily. So now we're going to select at least three files to add to our video. So you can see some videos and photos here. I'm not going to use any of those. I want to upload mine. So I'll just find where my videos are and I'm going to upload them into Canva. So in these videos, I was trying to create a promotional video for this particular watch here. So this is what all these are. So you can see it has uploaded them now. It says it is 7 out of 10 selected. Yeah, so the maximum is around 10 files which you can upload for this. Next, we are going to describe what we want our video to be about. So I have typed in here, video to promote a rose gold watch with pink straps for Musioki watches. And by the way, if you're enjoying this video, ensure you like it and subscribe to the channel. It really helps with the algorithm. Let's move on to the next step. So you may have to wait a little bit for them to completely upload. You can also go to the upload section to see the progress as they continue uploading. Now, once it's done, we're going to go back to the design here. So click on that. And now we're going to just select our videos since they have already completed uploading. So I'm going to have to repeat the prompt. It is a video to promote the rose gold watch with a pink strap from Musioki watches. Click on generate. Yeah, so this is what Canva has created for us. Let's watch it. Yeah, so I've just muted the music on your end, but it has some music in there. Okay, not too bad. So now we have to start editing this to make sure it looks like what we want it to look like. So the first thing, let's look at the first section here. So this one says introducing the rose gold watch with pink strap from Musioki watches. I like this one. I also like this uh, particular font that it has chosen. And also I like this background color. It has really tried to match it to this. So the first thing I want to do is that I want to make this a bit bigger there just to ensure that I have that section only inside. Okay, and then for the second one, let's see the text. The text says this watch is the perfect accessory for any occasion. I think that text is perfect. I'll just enlarge this one there. Yeah, and then we can look at the third one here. I didn't have a problem with this one. For the fourth one here, I think we need to adjust this. So the text is awesome. I don't have a problem with that. But I have a problem with the fact that when this watch are sort of false, we are still capturing that. So now to edit it, you just click on the video here and then you go to this trim feature there. And now we can trim it to what we want our video to showcase. So let's look for a nice section here. Yeah, I think we can have that one playing. Yeah, I think that one is okay. In the fifth one, I'm just going to pull this one up again until there, just so that we have it sort of zoomed in. In the other one here, again, we're going to pull this up a little bit. Yeah, so it's just now playing around with the video until you have exactly what you want. So in the last one here, this one requires a bit more editing because I'm actually inside this video. So I'll just scroll until I can find where I'm actually showing the watch. So maybe this one here. Or we can have it. Uh, let me pull it further. So maybe that one can uh, suffice. So we can have this one as done. But I also want to add in another one here. So just add in a new slide here. This one will come somewhere here. So it's just putting the logo here because this is a part of the brand kit. So I want to add another video section here. So we'll go to the uploads. We know it's already here. So this one is what we want to add here. And then for this one, I want to trim it to the very last part. 
I think I do something fun there. Okay, maybe until there. Okay, and then we can set this one as a background. Yeah, so that looks so much better. So something else that you can do, you can either use the music that it has selected for you, or you could go into Canva and find other music that you would like to use. Alternatively, you can upload your own music, or you can even download it as it is. And then when you are uploading to the particular platform, whether it is in Instagram Reels or even TikTok, you choose a specific sound from that particular platform. But still on the sound, if you click on your music here, you can be able to adjust just the volume so you just come to the volume here and then you can reduce it to whatever you would like it to be another thing that you can do is that you can actually synchronize a change in the video with a change in beat in the music so just come to the beat sync here and then maybe you could uh, put it on there and then now every time there's a beat it's going to probably change the scene at that section and then it's going to sync the video with your music it has done just that I also want to reduce this one up to somewhere here because I don't necessarily necessarily need this logo here and then we're also going to adjust the music further here by going to the audio effects now you can decide whether you want it to fade in and fade out i can have it both fading in maybe at 0 0.5 for both okay fade in fade out at 0 0.5 there and you can also adjust even further where you want the particular music to be so other things that you could do is when you click on the particular video you can click on edit video here and then you can come maybe to the highlight section uh, to help you select what is the best part of that video if you don't want to do it manually like we did for the last one you can also remove the background of your video and you can even add filters i could decide to add this filter here and maybe reduce the intensity so there's so many things that you can do with your video but i really love that canva has this feature let's download and watch our final video now so i'm just going to go to download and show you download it as an mp4 yeah so let's see what our final video looks like Yeah, so that is our final video. I think it looks really nice. You can now take it and share to whatever platform that you'd like to share it with. So I hope you can see the power of this. You can use it for your explainer videos. You can use it for promotional videos. You can even use it to create Instagram reels. If you want to watch more videos like this, ensure you subscribe to the channel. You can also watch the video on your screen to learn more ways about how to use Canva. My name is Paris and I'll catch you on the next one.